Salvete Spectatores, it's Master Pust. Welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4. We're playing Germany, the German Reich, the Deutsches Reich, in the 1939 start. We conquered Poland, we conquered France, we conquered Denmark and Norway. Now, you all know what's going <laughs> to come next. So, we could go historical and attack the Soviet Union or try to take out Great Britain. Which does not have a lot of planes, only 1200 to our 500 planes. Um, we are produce, uh, researching the Focke Wolf 190 and also the Panzerkampfwagen 4. So, there's that. This will be our new frontline units. Ooh, they have a lot of tanks, the Soviets. Interesting. So. Let's have a look. We have, well, we do air innovations at the moment. I would like to clear out the Balkans before going east. Greece is still... Does Italy have a claim on Greece? They don't, they do not. They could do it with war with Greece over here, but alas, they are doing air innovations. A modernized army here, okay. Whatever, they're not in a war with anybody yet. And I don't really want them to, because they will only get... Uh, these are my bulwark in the south, they are in my faction and they're holding uh, the allies off from doing anything. Okay. This he these here are my divisions that are protecting this land. I will select all the finished ones. I don't need a, that much of them. Oh, stop. We have a few more. They will add to the Eastern Front. Alright. So, these guys are all not yet trained, they will train further. We have our defensive... Oh, do they have another... Yeah, they, I think they have another uniform. Now I have a, a mod on where all the uniforms are different from the different troop types. I also have the chapel uh, leader portraits on, which is a must to my mind. Still could invite Yugoslavia, what I'm not gonna do have some planes in reserves. Let's have a look at the air mode. Not doing any... interesting. Where does Great Britain have its planes? Alright. I could try to bomb the English channel. Let's try that. We want to... Uh, I only have one fighter, so I don't want to set my close air support or naval bombers in air without having fighter protection, so that's not gonna happen for mo now. Let's unpause. They're telling me that there's... Oh, naval combat, okay. Oh, now, they, now it updated, yes. They have bombers and fighters here. Which is fine for now. What am I producing? All the stuff. Yeah, that's alright. Mm-hmm. Do I have a lack of anything? Only light tanks, which we will replace with medium tanks as soon as this happens. We have a hundred infantry divisions. I could increase that number. I still have a lot of manpower. Twelve mountaineers. Uh, we will need a lot of mountaineers actually in the south, so I want to have another twelve mountaineers if possible. I'm training here some SS divisions, which is fine. I could increase that to two. Uh, no, let's have just one. They will deploy in Brandenburg. Let's train another Edelweiss division, which is this flower, I believe. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Perfect. And furthermore. The Ghost Division has the medium tanks, yes. And this is the old Ghost Division. Okay, perfect. I eventually will want to replace 
my infantry with blitz divisions. I also need more paratroopers. Let's train 12 paratroopers. Good, also in Berlin. Infantry I don't need anymore, I think. And the rest will be blitz divisions and tanks. Good. What's up there in the north? This 24 army, uh, I don't want them to garrison this. Let's get back to... Let's select the infantry and give them to Gerrit von Runstedt on the eastern front. And this is still our tank army. Um, let's put them... Oh, Hungary is not dead in our faction, right. Can't do that. I don't know, let's just make another front. Gray is easy, distinguishable. Okay. I will expand my garrison force, which has nearly finished training, to the north. I have to, because maybe British troops will land there. So you guys move along. We finished Air Innovations 2. Could go for the extra research slot, but first I want to take out Yugoslavia. The Treaty of saint germain en laye saw many historic Austrian territories pass to our successor states. To out two successor states. With Austria once again united with the German nation, it is time to end these injustices. Injustices. The historic province of Carniola and Styria, which are known now as Slovenia, must be brought home. Now this is not perfectly correct, but we'll see over that. So what's the national foci for the other nations? Fortification effort completely useless. <laughs> Ooh, extra research slots. Jarre de Padai. Workers' culture, alright. Liberty ships and Japan, you're doing great. Sweet. Reinforce the Soviet border, okay. I want to attack the Soviet Union once Japan has taken out China. That's a must. Then they can reshuffle a lot of troops to the north and occupy a lot of forces in the east because they have a lot of divisions. Uh, 200? We have 128, so they have the majority. Actually, let's have a look here. I want all the Romanian stuff. Huh, why can't I do that? Oh, no, they're not our puppet, they're just our... Uh, just our allies, basically. So that's that. What are we doing here? Ooh, there's a lot of sabotage, actually. I want to do all this stuff up. Shit. In France, there's a lot of sabotage. That's bad. Should repair the factories first. Uh, we're only repairing at the moment, nothing else. Um, so these guys will also have to... Yeah, in Poland there's prob there are problems as well. Oh, no, that's not what I wanted. So these guys will also have to guard Poland. Basically every territory that is not... Hmm. Nice, Communist China has capitulated. That's perfect. Yep, Japan is doing alright. Japan will, will prevail here. We will add a few more, like 16 divisions. To this one. Because this is actually quite bad, the... the tr uh, not attrition, the defiance of the people. These guys will be trained soon. These guys started their training. Ah, we're lacking something here. Infantry equipment, interesting. Where's the upgrades? Upgrade, yeah, we'll be done with the upgrades soon as well. Light tank still missing. Come on, finish your research. Sweet, 10 days. 
Soviet Union white peace with Finland. Again? They gave up these two states? Okay. I don't know what Finland's doing. They have no idea, apparently. Mm, we'll... They're not technically training, so I will put them on dark blue and defensive. Okay. Ooh, they're still, rec uh, still green. Leon Trotsky got assassinated. Once the top lieutenant, Air Air Presumptive of Vladimir Ilyich Lenin, died today at a Mexican hospital. He was attacked in his home with an ice axe by a Spanish national believed to have been the employee of the NKVD. Interesting. So, he dies most of the time, of course, every time in historic setups. And he can become the new leader of the Soviets when the purge fails or when the player chooses to. I have never done that. May, I may try that one time. I have to look up on the internet what to exact, exactly we have to do to achieve that. Yes, we finished Panzerkampfwagen 4. Sweet. And Focke Wolf. Perfect. We could go for the Panther, which is not a good idea. Let's have a look at industry. We're not yet in 40... One, uh, 43. Ah, we still started out ahead here, so we don't even do that properly. I want... Oh, atomic research is already underway. Could go for the next radar tech. But there's no need, I guess. Air Doctrine, we could do something. Uh, naval Bombers, I will want eventually. Heavy Fighter are useless, to my mind. Tactical Bombers... Mm, I w don't need Tactical Bombers. I need Close Air Support, Fighters, Naval Bombers and maybe Strategic Bombers, but not a really big fan of that. Jet Engine stuff, not interesting. Why is this grayed out? This x the Messerschmitt 262 actually existed. Why is this grayed out? I don't know. Okay. Mm. Do I want to do the naval bomber? I don't know. We'll see. Let's have a look if there's something more important. We hold on, uh, we're holding out on these two, the last two here. Ooh, definitely. The Feldhaubitze. Tanks, not important. Ooh, we could go for this as well. And infantry support stuff. Let's go for the second Feldlazarett Field Hospital. Good. And that's, now we have to reshuffle some. I want two full lines of Panzerfiers. We can edit them some. How much actually? Uh, only two. Uh, let's keep that experience for now. Maybe we want to alter our divisions still. So, four of these guys up to the top, uh, two whole stacks of these guys up to the top. And I want three, uh, uh, maybe three lines is too much, yeah, three lines of fighter two, let's edit them. Let's call them, I don't know, mm, what's a cool air name? I don't know, let's think about it. How much can we spend here? Okay, all in all, 8 points. Uh, reliability is not the biggest concern here. Range is nice, but not too important. Weapons and engine increases the fighting power. So weapons and engine cancel out. Reliability goes down. So like this is, uh, it's pretty nice. And if we put the range up, reliability goes goes down. Nah, I don't want that. This is this is pretty nice. We get more speed by a bit, more air attack, and more range. I think I'm I'm okay with that. Let's call it uh, Steinadler, which means this is the brown eagle, the stone eagle. And we'll produce three whole lines of this sweet bird. We will cancel the support of the Kanonenvogel. And one more. Not 
here, just full, fully up. Okay, we can cancel one motorized. We will cancel... We have five, nearly 5k of these. We will cancel two support equipment. Artillery, we have enough, so we will cancel one. And we need... Infantry equipment, I won't pull down. Motorized, we're good on our way. Hmm, what can we cancel? Maybe one support? How, how are our divisions looking? These guys have fully equipped stuff. These guys are also finished. Blitz Division is fully equipped. Kampfadler, not yet. Something is missing. Signal Company. They don't have anything, oh my god. We need Signal Company and Recon here. How much does this cost? Uh, a lot of infantry, actually. We have enough for this. Mm -hmm, only the infantry. Our support is lacking now still. Okay. We need infantry and support. Motorized, we're good. So let's reduce one here. And one here. Ah, we still need two more rows. I still want my fighter to be on max production. Maybe the three lines is a bit too much. Mm. We can decrease motorized still one more. And one more here. Now we're fully up. And then push support and motorized. So we have, I think, a lot of lacking stuff here. We'll assess that in a second. Okay. I want first and foremost we have some Italian fighters here. Control over Northern France. So let's make one fighter wing. Deployers. What? The Soviet Union is justifying on us. Are you kidding me? Let's increase this to 200 for now. Oh, come on. But I'll not send them in just yet. Let's first see how, how we are producing our stuff. Okay, we, we lack a lot, a lot of resources. We have a few lines of civilian factories, which is nice. So, we need chromium, but chromium... Uh, the, do the tanks need chromium? No, the tanks don't need chromium. Only our ships, which I don't care about at all, so we'll... Leave this one alone. Steel, we have a surplus. Aluminum, we have a surplus. We need 28 rubber. We can get pretty much nothing. I can get one from Siamese Empire. We'll do that to linder our la uh, lack. We need a lot of tungsten. We'll get two from Japan. We need three more. One from Greece. And two from Portugal, maybe. Uh, Sweden. Hey buddy, need a few more. Ah, still. I don't want to waste any. And oil, who can we get oil from? Romania. Uh, Venezuela, is there a better partner? Iran. And Venezuela, we need... Holy crap, this is expensive. Okay, so our... <sighs> rubber, rubber is a problem. We, we, I don't know, we have, we have a lot, but we still need more. Synthetic refineries. Okay, so which guy do I have at the moment? The military factory guy, so I will actually install the civilian guy and build more refineries. How is the resistance? It's not that bad now, but still could be improved. Units still training. I don't want to quick deploy them, they might have to fight at some point. 
They're really justifying our goal. Sweet. Conquer Mammal? Are you kidding? Okay. These guys. I cannot in... Did they just gobble up Estonia? I must have missed that. Interesting. Yeah, justify war goal Estonia. Maybe they just faulted? I... I, n I never saw that. Interesting. So they... A truce with Finland, justifying war goal. Okay, they don't have anything against Lithuania and Latvia. Could I justify against them? It would only take me 25 days. Hmm. I definitely want Hungary in my faction because they have quite a nice amount of divisions. Resistance in a lot of provinces. Hmm. Need more men in this division. Yeah, they could train a little bit because I altered the setup. These guys are okay. Mm -hmm. This is a little bit a little bit of a more peaceful episode, but this is the, the silence before the storm. Should know that. Hungary, do they have war goals? No. What? We have from Hungary volunteers, yes. I want them to join our faction. Why don't they want to? Okay, now they could try to... De Are you kidding? Soviet Union declared on us. On the whole axis. Holy crap. I do not want to call Japan in, if even if I could. Are they even in our ex? Uh, no, they're not in the Axis yet, yeah, oops. Okay. Shit, I, I just started training. I'm such an idiot. I'm such an idiot. Okay, we'll, this will change our plans. We might have to pull some of these guys off. These guys will definitely join the front here. Don't need them anywhere else. The tanks. I will try to... Here there's a lot of planes, so let's move them to the south here. And let's pick half of these guys to assist on this front as well. Okay. The USSR breaks the Molotov Ribbentrop Pact. They're very pissed that we didn't give them Eastern Poland. The non aggression pact between Germany and the Soviet Union, a surprising development to begin with, has now less surprisingly fallen apart. The Soviet Union has attacked, breaking the pact, and vowing to crush the German regime, and once again put the expansionist state in their pace. place. German leaders may have been planning an attack themselves, yes, we have, but the world will never know. They're now rapidly mobilizing. Communists have no sense of honor or pride. National focus bypassed war with the USSR. I'm glad we didn't do that. Sweet. So, we will change our air setup. Problem is... I'm pretty sure that these are US bombers. Yeah, they have a lot of... Oof. They ha have been producing stuff before we did. So, they have a lot of planes. Holy crap. I'm, and this takes some time to get started with. Italy wants to send 14 expeditionary forces. Yes, give me all your stuff. So we're getting pushed back at some fronts because we were training, which is bad. These guys joined, yes. Not too worrying. But we will regain our... Yeah, they're pushing back now uh, on the... Stop it. They're redeploying some. I will want them to have their full attack bonus and org at some point. We have 89 divisions on this front. Okay, redeploy. Romania wants to send 25. Okay. What are you doing? Oh, these are the Italian divisions.
get over here. Get your lazy asses over here. And I want to extend this line all the way to here. Good. So this takes some time now, the reshuffling and stuff. USSR tanks are attacking. Let's have a look at their division. Four to eight tanks and two motorized. This is a quite a heavy division, actually. Medium tank we are producing. So let's pump... Uh, do I want to change our divisions to the proper ghost division? Let's get them here. And garrison here. And change them to the normal ghost division. We will need a thousand medium tanks. Wow. And some support stuff. Okay. I just have to be careful that on the Western Front there's no incursion. I will micro heavily once our guys have arrived in every place. What does the plan say? Some divisions not in position. Inferior enemy, really. Okay. Yeah, they're arriving. Yeah, now we finished Slovenia. I'm interested in if they will do it or not. Let's wait if, uh, one day or something. I'm pretty sure they will not accept. They never did in my let's plays. Uh, we have unfulfilled import demands from Iran. Okay, where could we get oil still? Hmm. Only the US. I don't want to trade with these suckers. Do we have a war goal? Yeah, they didn't say yes. I, due to some reason there is no indication that they said no. But it is what it is. So we can't do the first Ljubljana award yet. We could do the second Vienna award. Which would promote Hungary even more. Ah, I want their extra research now. This is most important. Where's the best airport? I would need one right over here. Let's pick maybe this one. And put 600 fighters in there. Interesting, here we have naval superiority. Sweet. Allied bombers. Okay. How many fighters do we have? Oh, it's quite slow. Slow progression. A few support planes. Um, in this one we will put our close air support stuff. We have a thousand, so that's okay. These guys are quite strong. But we will have to wait until we get more More fighters. Still, again, Japan, what are you doing? Which resource? Tungsten. Who is more reliable? Portugal, why not? Mm -hmm. The Soviets withdrew against the Japanese, interesting. And we could attack Yugoslavia, which is not an option. Iran, again, has not enough oil. This will be all for now, but I will see you in the next episode. I thank you all for watching. See you soon.